Hello friends, welcome to Kickstart Instrumentation. In this video, I am going to discuss with you the function of two-way manifold wall. The shown image is a two-way manifold wall. This is wall 1, this is wall 2. You see here, there is a connection here and connection 2 here and connection 3 here. So why this connection 1? This connection 1 is a process connection which will be connected to the process so that the process medium will enter into this wall. And what is this connection? It is instrument connection. So in this connection, the field instrument will be connected. For example, pressure transmitter, pressure switch, pressure cage, like that. It will be connected in this connection and what is this connection it is drain to drain the process medium we have a wall and from the using this wall we will drain okay now first I have to connect the process connection so when I connect with the main pipeline maybe water oil etc so when we connect and if there is isolation wall and if it is open it will be filled with the process medium now valve 1 as well as valve 2 is in closed position at this position it is safe to install the instrument to connect with the manifold wall so how we are going to do it will be connected with male or female connector as per the specification chosen to avoid the leak what we have to do we have to use a small teflon tape so that it is fixed properly and there is no further leak so now the instrument is also connected now the instrument is ready to measure the process medium pressure for example now what i have to do i have to open this wall when i open this wall the process medium will enter into the instrument as well as it will enter into the valve 2 which is for drain. Now the instrument will be showing the pressure value but with some error deflecting. Why this is happening? Why because there will be air bubbles present in this process medium due to which the instrument will be deflecting. So how we can remove these air bubbles? For that we use a drain. So now I open the drain wall and drain the water for some time until the air bubbles are removed. So once the water is steady or continuous you can close the wall so that there will not be any drain. Now the instrument will measure the perfect pressure of the process medium. Okay, fine. Now during the maintenance, you want to remove the instrument for some calibration work. So how it has to be removed? So to remove that, you have to follow this procedure. First, you have to close this wall so that the process medium going into the instrument will be stopped. Now I close this one, but still process medium present in this pipe which is still having influence on the instrument. So this has to be removed. For that, you have to open the drain wall and drain them completely. So when I open the drain wall, see it is completely draining it out. Now we are ready to remove the instrument without any cause or any issue. You can remove safely and you can take it through your laboratory for calibration or whatever you want to do. And once you finish all the works, again the process will be repeated for connecting the instrument and connecting the process medium into the instrument and draining and etc. This is how two-way manifold wall functions. Thank you friends. Let us see you in the next video.